Good morning, happy Wednesday. I realized on the way to daycare, I didn't put any makeup on, so I normally just wear mascara, but looking a little, <laughs> a little uh, washed out, not even washed out. I don't know, it's just like my eyes don't pop like they do. Anyway, this morning before I dropped Mabel off at daycare, I needed to return the Briar Club. And you'll understand why later, because I think I'll get to haul a book later. Um, it was on like the two week shelf and I thought it said one renewal. And so I was tried to renew it on my app and it didn't work. So I want the physical copy because that is my Patreon book club book for July. So I just bit the bullet and bought it. And I think it's coming today. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I returned that, um, dropped Mabel off. I'm here at church, kind of a busy day. We have Bible study. Um, my two of my coworkers are taking me out for lunch today, just as a end of my time here celebration. Uh, so we'll go out to eat. Uh, then Mabel has a well child check this afternoon. It's her like two and a half year appointment. I don't know if she needs shots this time around or if it's just a checkup. And then I think I'm actually going to fold laundry and do the dishes tonight. We'll see. Hold me to it. There should be a cleaning montage later in the video. <laughs> um, I am going to sit here and eat my cereal, probably watch some YouTube. Oh, I get to start a new audiobook today. The audiobook that won in my Patreon poll was After I Do by Taylor Jenkins Reid. So I'm excited to start that one. Um, I've read all of her new like historical fiction stories like those four that kind of go together they're in the same world daisy jones evelyn hugo malibu rising and oh carrie soto but i haven't read any of her backlist so i'm excited to give that a try with after i do i don't know if i'll have time to listen today but just the excitement of starting a new audiobook hopefully will get me pop in an earbud at some point. Anyway, let's get the day started. cleaning so I'm gonna open this package that I got today it's the one I referenced earlier so we all know what it is but it's still very exciting oh it's so pretty Ta -da! very gorgeous oh no it has deckled edges I really don't like deckled edges but whatever, it's a beautiful book. I'm excited to read it. Uh, again, this is my Patreon book club, Book for July. And I absolutely love Kate Quinn. Um, I've loved The Huntress and The Rose Code. I think those are the only two I've read. Oh no, uh, her newest that she wrote with Jamie Chang called The Phoenix Crown. Um, that just came out this year and I liked that one too. Um, but I've heard very good reviews of this so far. <gasps> what? You need more soap? She's a cleaning fiend, that girl. Okay, I'll get some. One second. Uh, I've heard really good things, uh, especially from Amy from A Star Reads. She gave this four and a half stars. She loved the ending, I know, especially. So I'm excited that I own a copy of this. Uh, I think that's all I got. Yep, so uh, Mabel and I came home from her doctor's appointment. She's completely healthy and she's very happy she had no shots today. Uh, we came home, we got tater tot hot dish in the oven and we cleaned up the kitchen. So we did 
one of the tasks I knew we needed to do tonight. The other is folding laundry. So hopefully after dinner, we can go play downstairs and while the kids and daddy play, I'll fold laundry. But I can listen to after I do. I started after I do today. Uh, I had a little bit of time to myself this afternoon. Um, so I started after I do and I think it's gonna be good. Um, we start with a man and woman who are in a marriage and then we see that they're having some hard times. We jump back 11 years prior to when they meet and we see how they fall in love. We see how they fall in love and it's really beautiful and then we see them get married, we see them get angry, we see them fall out of love. So they have come to the decision that they are going to take a break from each other for a whole year and they want to like really not see each other and just try to live their own lives because they started dating like sophomore year in college so they don't really know adult life without each other. So they're giving it a try. And we're mostly following the female character, Lauren. Uh, her husband is, I feel like it starts with an R. Can't think of it. Um, but she is already having a tough time. So we'll see where it goes, but I'm enjoying it so far. I'm like already 25% through, so that's great. Mabel's cleaning. We're waiting for Theo and Willie to get home. And we'll clean more this evening. Here's the tater tot hot dish cooking. Mmm. Comment down below if you use the term hot dish or casserole. Minnesota is known to use hot dish and that's the correct term, obviously. Look at this girl. Now she decided to clean the mat. Thanks, May. Also, uh, get you need more soap on there? Yeah. Okay, thanks, girly. Also, yeah. oh, you probably saw in the background, Mabel broke my Martin Luther bobblehead, which is too bad, but it's okay. He'll just go in the trash. <laughs>